Hey YouTube, I'm Eris. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we're going to be following a TikTok tutorial of a soft glam makeup look. This is my first time doing this type of look, so I'm very excited. So without further ado, let's hop right into this video. video posted right next to me on my tablet so i'm going to be watching it I'm going back and forth between the camera and my tablet so i have all my supplies here i'm not going to list the names you're going to see me use them so yeah but let's get started okay so the first thing she does she applies her foundation but i'm going to go in first with foundation primer all the products i'm going to be using are from mary Kay. my, my mother is a mary Kay beauty consultant so i do use mary Kay products for my skincare and beauty needs And then I am going in with some oil mattifier because I do have oily skin. Okay, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna get my mirror so that I can use it when I'm doing my makeup. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, I have my mirror. It's gonna be posted right here. My tablet's right here, the camera's right here. Okay, so the first thing she does, she goes in with liquid foundation, but I don't have liquid foundation, so I'm gonna be using powder foundation. Um, it's in the color beige too. It's minimum powder foundation, and I need to actually get some in the container. It's... So, I'm gonna go in with some foundation, and she goes all around her face. I actually never do my foundation first. So this is very different. I always do my concealer and my eyebrows first. Cause that's just the way I was taught to do it. For my mom. But I guess we're going in with foundation first today. And if this look is successful, I'm going to be doing this makeup look like as an everyday makeup look. When I go back to college, I can just be pretty every day. So yeah. It literally looks like I don't have anything on my face. Which I guess is the goal. So let's see the next thing that she does. Okay, the next thing she does, she does go in with her concealer. So I am using Perfection Concealer in the color Light Bronze. And so she puts it just like this on her face. Here and here. <coughs> and, then, and then here in here and she does like this little triangle thing not triangle but like an arrow looking thing here and here i think that looks okay okay so i'm gonna go with my sponge i'll be right back okay i don't do my concealer like this either i just go under my eye under my eye and then i do spot treatments but so this is very new and different for me Let me make sure I'm doing this right. Oh boy. When she applies her concealer under her eyes, she goes all the way out to the side of her face. Wish my hair would leave me alone. She goes all the way out to the side of her face. Like all the way over here. It literally looks like I don't have anything on my face, but that is okay. Okay, so then she goes in with what I'm assuming is setting powder. She doesn't list the thing that she uses. So I'm gonna be using this setting powder, a silky setting powder in the color Deep Beige. So she puts this all over the places where she apply her concealer. Mostly under her eye though. And then I think she applies is applies is I think she applies bronzer on her chin and I mean not her chin her cheeks but let me rewind yeah so she applies this bronzer on her cheeks right here and then on her forehead so I'm gonna do that I have this bronzer stick cream bronzer duo stick um in the color honey and luster <laughs> okay 
you think? I've never applied bronzer, so chill on me if I'm doing it wrong. I really blend them on my skin. Okay, y'all, please chill on me. I feel like I'm doing this so wrong. I've never done this before. I don't know, like, I have nothing on my face. Like, I kind of like it, but I'm kind of like, am I doing this right, you know? Okay, and then she goes in with some blush. So that's what I'm gonna do. I have this cream blush duo stick in the color Pink and Glimmer. So we're gonna do that. Yo, I don't use blush either. Oh. Is that too much, guys? Like but this stick is thick. It's thick. It don't like my face. Like I'm not happy. There is no color on my face. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna do a hack that I have learned for the blush. We're gonna use. We're gonna use some eyeshadow. We're gonna use the lip eyeshadow. This is the Pink Starlight Mary Kay lip eyeshadow. So I'm just gonna apply a few dots here. I'm gonna use that as blush because it looks more like highlight. See, see, see. This is what I'm talking about. I can't do that right. It added some color though. My face don't look dull. Yeah. And then she goes and contours her nose. I've never contoured my nose. Uh, I'm gonna assume that she used. I'm gonna assume that she used bronzer. The contour, but this stick is thick, like the blush stick. So I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Okay, so I put some of the bronzer on my nose and it doesn't look like it's doing anything. <laughs> but it's okay. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. And then she put some spray on. So I'm going in with a Mary Kay finishing spray. So then she does her eyebrows. So that's what I'm gonna do. She brushes them up. And then she fills them in. So I'm gonna go sharpen this. Okay, so I brought my mom's brow liner because I can't find a sharpener. So she just fills in her eyebrows a little bit. Okay, it looks so much darker on camera every single time. This one looks way thicker. But then she does the concealer under her eyebrows. So I'm applying this makeup right, and I really don't have nowhere to go today. I just gotta pick up my driving schedule from my driving school so that I can start like my driving behind the wheel hours. And that's all I really need. So I'm just putting this makeup up for no reason to be honest. But it's for a video, so it's for a real talk, you know? Okay, and then she goes in with some eyeshadow. She uses really dark eyeshadow, but that doesn't really look well on me. So I'm gonna be going in with some lighter eyeshadow. And of course, I don't know where my eyeshadow brushes are. So we're going to be using my finger. Usually I use my sponge, but that's been, I think it's been ruining my 
my, uh, <clears throat> my palette. So, this is still kind of dark, but it's not like the dark brown that she's. Like, she's the really dark brown. And the color I'm using is Sienna Skies from the Mary Kay eyeshadow palette. Don't mind the, the eyeshadow in the mirror, chill on me. Y'all, this is annoying. Using your finger is annoying. Okay, that's as good as this one get. I'm sorry, I quit. <laughs> And then she goes and she puts some glitter on her eyes. I'm just gonna use this liquid eyeshadow. It's gonna be starlight. It's really glittery, so I'm just gonna use this. I'm just gonna put it here. And then I'm gonna blend it in with my sponge. It's really cute on this side, and it got messed up on this side. What the heck? All right, let's try this again. <laughs> It looks really cute on this side, and it really got messed up on this side. But it's my first time, so we just gonna roll with it. We gonna roll with it. It'll perfect as I go on. And then she does. She does my mascara, but she uses a brush to like lift up her eyelashes. I'm not doing that. Mascara. Mascara. This is the Mary Kay Lash Love Fan and Rama Mascara. Uh, yeah, in the shade black. So. I hate when that happens. I hate when that happens and it messes up both eyes. Like, I accidentally hit the inside of my eye with the freaking mascara. Now I'm crying. And then she goes in with some lip liner. She uses a dark one again. I don't have a dark one. I just have this one. It's a, a Mary Kay lip liner in the color Coral, I believe. And I don't do lip liner either, so I don't know what I'm doing with that for the most part. And I'm just gonna go in with like a nude color. Um, this is Unique Mauve and Mary Kay Unlimited Lip Gloss. If I can get open, okay. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit of glitter just to make it pop a little more. That didn't really do anything. But it's okay. <sighs> okay. It really looks like I did nothing to my face. And that's it. That's the look, y'all. This this is the look. I think it looks okay. It really looks like I don't have anything in my face. But I think that's the point in a soft limp look. You know, you're supposed to look flawless, but like it's not supposed to look like you did stuff to your face. So I think I achieved that part. Cause it looks like I have nothing in my face right now except for the lip gloss, my eyebrows lint, some eyeshadow, and mascara. And that looks pretty much it. But I think I did a pretty good job for my first time. It looks. I look cute. I look cute. I look good. And this is an everyday makeup look, and I I like it. But yeah. I just gotta perfect it a little more. I gotta get some darker bronzer so I can really pop my cheeks out a little bit. I need to find my eyebrow, my not my eyebrow, my eyeshadow brushes so I can actually apply some eyeshadow correctly. Last time I saw that, it was homecoming. Fall 2022. When I was back in college in my dorm, I haven't seen my brushes since. I don't know where they are. It is what it is. My eyebrows look good. I literally, it doesn't like apply any makeup to my face. And I like that. I like that. It looks really cute. So, I'm going to end the video here. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Hit the post notification button to notify every time I post a new video so you can stay updated. Keep up with me, you know? And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.